<laughs> Greetings. Today is Saturday, April 15th, and it is day 15 of my 30-day uh, liquid fast. It is now 10 p.m. in Los Angeles, and I almost didn't record this, but I'm walking on the treadmill. I paused it, um, cause I've pretty much rested. Um, I've been just napping for the last mm, three days. So like Thursday, Friday, and today. I did a lot of napping, which was really good cause I think I was tired uh, considering I usually end up going to bed around <laughs> one o'clock in the morning so I think I was just really really tired this morning I had I had a green juice um, I had some grapes and just water today um, my foot is improving I'm not like when I wake up in the morning it's not like it's not like all of this pain I really like that um I can't wait till this is over with because I want to go to the gym and work out. But I have a little burst of energy probably from sleeping. So I decided to walk on the treadmill. I'm only going to do this for like 30 minutes. I was going to go walking outside, but I'm, it's kind of chilly outside. So I'm just like, I'm not walking nowhere. It's, I'm cold. So um, I just to, decided to do just walk on the treadmill inside. Um, so, yeah. <clears throat> um, so I discontinued my coconut water because that was just way too sweet, or at least it tastes too sweet for me. And um, my my daughter, she's 17, and so she was asking me about um, doing this uh, liquid fast with me also. And so at first I was like, yeah, you could do it. And then I thought about it. I was like, well, she likes a lot of junk food and um, all of that stuff. And so I was like, you know what? Um, on second thought, just eat fruit and vegetables. And, um, and then, you know, I told her that so I could kind of like get her to stop eating junk food because she likes she's like a 17 year old she's a lot of potato chips and all this kind of stuff so I'm like you don't need all of that so um <clears throat> that's where I am with that she apparently likes pineapples like a whole lot because I, I bought two pineapples she ate both the pineapples I'm like you're not the only person in the house like how you gonna eat both the pineapples um but anyway um, so I feel really good. Um, I just was, I was tired, so I needed to rest, but I feel good. Oh, whew, I did get a bump on my lip, um, but it's, it healed or like it went, it's gone away. Um, and then I do, I noticed that I had like a, a, a rash on my, on my thigh and it was like really really red it looked like strawberries or something on the top so um i didn't do anything to really you know fix it or nothing and so um that went away like i noticed it at night and then when i woke up it was gone um so um yeah so that's basically um where i am um I've been thinking about like when I'm done with this. Um, I've been listening to a lot of Dr. Robert Morse's videos and a lot of other videos on like uh, a, a healthy alternative, Jillian Berry's. Like I've been listening to all of these different podcasts and videos, the, the uh, Hubbard Huberman podcast and stuff like that on health and nutrition and. Um, uh vegetarian vegan diet and so i think when i'm done with the 30 days uh liquids um i'm going to i think i'm gonna continue this because um one i really do want to lose weight um 
and um, I want to I want to I just want to kind of like give my body a whole nother reset right um, I was thinking about some of the things that I like to eat I like eating ice which I stopped eating ice I haven't eaten ice in probably maybe about three days now and um and I like I'm a I'm a rice person I like rice with my food so I was like okay so how do I want to be with my food right so I was like do I want a meal prep portion control like I got all of these things that I think I want to do right but specifically I really want to go back to the um 30 days I think I'm gonna do 30 days of like Ross um when I'm done with this probably fruit I definitely want to try like three days of like grapefruit I mean not grapefruit three days of grapes and uh lemon and water um like a juice and then I want to do like three days of melons um and just like fruit and um I also want to do I get sleepy. It's around nine o'clock. I get sleepy, right? <clears throat> but I had this burst of energy. So I was like, oh, let me go walk in. And I went I went outside and it was like, no, it's cold out here. So then I came over here. So I'm yawning because I'm like, oh, I'm not tired again. So um I was I've been thinking about that. So I think I wanna do there. I'm gonna do when I'm finished with this, I'm gonna do like just maybe fruit and see how that goes. Um if I get too when I did this during February, I just felt so, I felt really great, but <laughs> it was kind of like, um, am I tripping? Like, you know, like, am I seeing things? You know, like I would have like these little flashes of, and all of this stuff, like spiritual stuff. And I was like, mm, I don't think I really want to have that experience just yet. So let me go eat some green vegetables. So I'm looking forward to that, but I really want to just kind of like give myself a chance to <clears throat> um, just give my body a complete and utter, uh, utter rest. And the reason why I'm saying that is because I was listening to Queen of Four and she was like, oh, yes, you know, you do. She was talking to, I think it was Angela Yee or Angela Rye, whatever the lady name is. <clears throat> And she was like, oh no, if you do your 21 day detox, you gotta do another one. You just getting started. And um, and so I was like, okay, well, I guess I gotta do another one. <sighs> so I'm looking forward to this though, you know, just like um, an elevation of my body, my mind, my spirit. And I wanna go, um, I'm gonna do these castor oil packs. I keep saying that I haven't done them yet. I want to go get a colonic, but I'm just probably going to use my Kalima Ward so I could just save some money because I'm also working on my money. Um, and I've been spending, yay me! Um, I've really been, you know, mindful of my spending habits. Um, so that's really promising. And then I saw an article because I do have a student loan. Um where that's supposed to be like the loans are supposed to be forgiven so i want to probably apply for forgiveness but i've really been really 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 mindful of like my spending and so i'm excited about that like no shopping and buying stuff when i get paid no you know just impulsive buys when i'm in the store if i go in the store for grapes I go in this one, I get the grapes. Although I do look at other stuff. The other thing I've been doing is this too, right? So while I'm fasting, you know, you get these cravings and you want stuff. And so um, like if I'm in the store, or I'm out and about and I smell food. I'm like, oh, I really want that. I just like stand wherever I am and I just inhale. Uh, and I allow myself to just enjoy the scent of whatever it is that i smell instead of being like oh god let me hurry up and get on from over here and all of that kind of stuff so um oh the other thing i did was i had some grapes this morning um globe grapes that i found at walmart uh with the seeds in them so i had some of those not that many though i had like Mm, maybe about five of them. 
Um, so yeah. Um, the only other thing that I noticed is I have to, so right now I'm able to drink about 70 ounces of water. I probably could increase that, but I don't be wanting to drink water after nine o'clock because I'm like, I don't want to be up all night peeing. So I think I need to start drinking earlier and then, um, and then work my way from there. Ooh. So anyway, I'm gonna um, log off and end this, but um, I just wanted to share, this is day uh, 15 and um, day 14 was uneventful, just some water. And um, that's basically it. So I'm about to go and I will talk to you guys later.